What's up guys, Tony here from LearnAutoBodyAndPaint.com. Just wanted to make this quick uh, video for Joffrey, uh, Mr. Joffrey here, uh, VIP member. Just, just a little bit of tad bad of information from my end. So he emailed in saying, hey Tony, how can I get side jobs coming in? Um, what are your, some of your tactics? The whole reason why I wanted to learn auto body and paint was to generate income on the side. So I emailed him, I says, hey, so what have you been doing? Have you completed any jobs? Have you taken any before and after photos? Have you promoted yourself? Let me know what you've been doing, thanks. Um, yes, I have a Facebook page for auto body and paint. I made business cards. Great, great, excellent, excellent. I have a page on Reddit. I'm not sure how much Reddit will help. I, I know Reddit is more of like uh, you know, a place for you know tech guys and code guys. Um, but you know, a lot of other things too, but I'm not sure about the car stuff for Reddit. Maybe there is, I, I don't spend much time on it, obviously. Um, I can't seem to pull in work. Here's some pictures. So when it comes to basically promoting with auto body, okay, most of it, I will tell you is word of mouth in your, in your circle. So tell everybody, you know, that you're doing auto body, take before and after pictures of everything that you do. And you thank you for sending in some images. Great work, by the way, it looks looks fantastic. Um, but it does take time to build up something like this, unless you want to get into paid advertising. Okay, so I just I would just say to you, keep doing what you're doing, take before and after pictures, you might want to do TikTok. Um, Instagram, I know will probably your, be your best shot in your local area. Um, you might want to test out some advertising and some classified ads because there's so many people doing social media. You can't forget a lot of, a lot of people still look on Craigslist and they still look on in print advertising, like your local penny saver. Okay. So you also might want to take out a couple of ads there. Uh, when I was doing auto body back in the day for clients, I don't do them for customers anymore. I just do my own stuff. Sometimes friends projects I'll help out, but I don't take on any customer clients uh, because it's just a pain in the butt. Working with customers is always going to be a pain in the butt. So that's why, you know, when I got into it, um, I did a lot of customer cars. I did a lot of friends and family cars and that's how it spread for me. Um, you know, just friends and family went a long way in college. Everybody was telling everybody I painted many of my college friends' cars, gave them deals, you know, $2,500 paint jobs. This is a long time ago, you know, $3,500 paint jobs, sometimes $1,500 paint jobs, completes. Um, but again, take before and after pictures of everything you do. Post on IG. You want to, want to make sure you tag your local area. Uh, be active on Facebook and your groups. Let me see. I think you sent me your little uh, group thing here. So hopefully this video actually gets you some... Uh, some views as well. Um, Jeff's Auto Body and Paint. Um, you could also start doing some paid advertising. So that's that's the way to do it, you know, paid advertising. I'm not sure if you have a shop or if you're working out of your small home, but you can kind of, if you're working out of home, you can say, hey, uh, you know, affordable custom body and paint jobs uh, and say something like, yes, I work from home, but I do quality work. You know, we could do motorcycles, scooters, whatever you want. Um, and you could even throw in like uh, airbrushing. Maybe you know somebody that does airbrushing. So you could basically do the, the painting part, but then you sub out the airbrushing artwork, you know. Um, so you know, for me, I was never an art guy, uh, you know, uh, an artist, so to say. I like to do like custom. Um, I could do flames and, and stuff like that, you know, like multi-line striping and all that. But I never I was never good at like detailed airbrush art. So if you know somebody in your local area, you could go talk to him and be like, hey, what if I got you jobs? Would you give me a little discount? You know, um, and then you can work that into your your paint jobs. You can say, hey, you know, we, we have an airbrush guy and then you work together um, and, and feed each other jobs. You know, that can work as well. So I would say continue, you know, do get what you can do what you can take before and after photos like you've been doing. Um, and then keep spreading the word on social media. You know, social media is kind of funny. Just because you do a couple of posts for a little while, for a month maybe, and then you stop, you know, it just, just you got to keep doing it. You know, just by doing a couple of posts, as I was saying, is not going to get you a flood of traffic. You got to be constant at social media. That's the thing. So, 
you may even want to repost the same pictures, you know, in, in like a circular, you know, just rotate, rotate like past jobs that you did. So maybe you have a month of before and after photos you can upload, you know, just regurgitate them, you know, put like. Uh, unless you want to get into the paid ads, paid ads is a different thing. I don't know if you want to get into paid ads or not, but you can test out Facebook marketing, target like local in your area, local like paint things in your area, um, you know, paint groups, custom groups, car groups, motorcycle groups in your area uh, with affordable paint stuff, you know. Um, you could even start your own little mini YouTube channel of all the stuff that you're doing, record what you're doing and then post videos. And then you always want to make sure that you put your your local area in there so people can contact. Like for me, um, I have a lot of people hit me up for paint jobs, but I'm like, hey, I don't do it for customers, man. Sorry, but I have a friend who does and I just give my friend work. So you could do stuff like that as well. Uh, all right. Hopefully this video helps. I'm sorry I couldn't give you any, you know, groundbreaking do this and you're going to get a flood of jobs. But I would just say, you know, for, for something like this, it's a buildup because the more people you know uh, and the more people that knows you do this, you're just going to keep, you know, people are going to have a friend and friend they're going to talk. And, oh, yeah, Jeff, Jeff does auto body. Go call him. You know what I mean? It happens to me all. You know, I don't do it for customers, but I still get people wanting me to do paint jobs nowadays, but I just don't do them. You know, it's not my thing anymore. But uh, hopefully this helps. Anyway, guys, Tony here from LearnAutoBodyAndPaint.com. If you want to learn auto body um, to, to make money from, kind of like this video here, uh, or restore your own custom projects, you know, do body kits, custom candy paint jobs, whatever you want to do, learn auto body A to Z. Don't forget to click over here uh, to get that free training at LearnAutoBodyAndPaint.com. Uh, it's going to look like, ah, whatever. I'll just have the link up. Just go to learnautobodyandpaint.com or click the link below this video to get some free books and trainings and whatnot. There's a lot of content here for you. And uh, like, share, subscribe. I'll talk to you soon. Peace.